I'm now on the Tanzania stand with Dr. Nzuki, Managing Director. Dr. Nzuki, I'd like to first of all congratulate you on what I think is probably an even bigger and better stand than last year. You've obviously taken advantage of the move within the, uh, within the show. Thank you, Tim. I mean, am I, am I right? Is it the biggest stand in last year? That's, that's correct. This, is, uh, this year has been uh, bigger than last year's. And, uh, you know, thanks that we have now moved to a new location where we could have uh, a, a much larger area. So it's been bigger and uh, very well built. Indeed. And you've obviously got more sharers coming with you this year as well. Definitely. We have about 60 companies, uh, including airlines, hotels, as well as tour operators. So That all sounds very encouraging. Now, when I came to your stand last year, um, there were some worries about how the economic recession was going to impact on visitor numbers. I suspected at the time that because of the strength and the diversity of Tanzania's tourism product, you were going to fare a lot better than others. Am I right in that assumption? Definitely. As, as you uh, quite rightly said, uh, 2000, 2009 wasn't a very good year, but uh, this year is going to be a bumper harvest year. We are going to, we expect about 15% increase from 2008 uh, visitor numbers. And I think this is because of the, uh, first of all, uh, I, I should say Tanzania being very uh, stable uh, since independence, as you understand, Tanzania has been very, very politically stable. Uh, it's a happy nation, uh, very friendly people. But in addition to that, you know, the many, uh, you know, natural resources, you know, tourism attractions. Mm. So those ones have, uh, you know, worked, worked very well, you know, in attracting our visitors. Excellent. Now, I also learned last year that uh, Tanzania is relatively unique in that it combines tourism and national resources responsibility under one remit, under one ministry. I, must, I guess that must help in terms of your ability to control responsible tourism development. That, that's correct. Actually, we've had uh, the, uh, the tourism department together with natural resources for quite some time now, and that has worked very, very well. As you would understand, the, uh, the, the key product, uh, as far as Tanzania tourism is concerned, is the wildlife. So, you know, Tanzania is, is sold predominantly as a wildlife uh, tourism destination. So being together, tourism together with the, uh, the wildlife division, uh, that works very, very well. You know, they uh, support each other. And the fact that, uh, as you would understand, Tanzania, you know, doesn't compromise with conservation. So we have, we Indeed. uphold conservation, uh, you know, very, very well. Uh, therefore, tourism as well as uh, wildlife resources uh, work very well in Tanzania. Thank you. Now, again, I learnt last year that the UK, which is a very strong uh, source market for Tanzania, had slipped to number two. We've been beaten by the Americans. Can, has anything changed in the last year? It has. Uh, the UK has gone up to, first, uh, to number one now, with 58,000 uh, visitors <laughs> annually. That is fantastic news. I'm very pleased to hear it. Thank and it you. sounds like World Travel Market will be an important venue for you for several years to come. Definitely. This uh, will continue being one of those very key strategies and important events for, events for Tanzania. Dr. Nzuki, thank you very much. Thank All you very best. much, team. Thank you very much.